Um, <clears throat> well, uh, I should point out that uh, Falcon outpost vehicle doesn't really have the same capability as, as either the Chinese, the Russian, or, or the space shuttle uh, vehicles that I mentioned. Um, Falcon would be in the, in the light class of launch vehicles, whereas the space shuttle would be a heavy class launch vehicle. Uh, so it's not, it's not quite an apples to apples comparison. Um, however, it, uh, the, the right comparison would be uh, Falcon compared to the Pegasus from Orbital Sciences. Falcon is 6 million, the Pegasus is 25 million. Um, and uh, the way we've, we've gotten our prices low, our costs low, uh, is we've really focused on every element of the launch vehicle. There's really no one silver bullet uh, that has, has um, been responsible for a substantial portion of, of the cost savings. It's been really hundreds of small innovations and improvements. And, and so we've, we've done improvements in the propulsion system, the structure, uh, the avionics, and the launch operations, as well as maintain a very low overhead organization. And when you add up all the things we've done in those areas, that allows us to produce a launch vehicle at six million dollars. Um, the uh, uh, as as far as uh, PayPal, um, th there were a lot of back office relationships that we needed to establish and to attach to various heterogeneous data sources. Um, we needed uh, to attach to the credit card system for processing credit cards. We needed to attach to the Federal Reserve system uh, for um, doing electronic funds transfers. Uh, we needed to attach to various fraud databases to run fraud checks. Um, there, there was a lot that we had to, uh, we had to interface with. Um, and and that, that, that took, that took a, a while. Um, but uh, uh, it, it all came together, I think, roughly simultaneously. I mean, developing the software and having it ready for, uh, for the general public uh, reasonably coincided with us being able to conclude those deals and interface with the outside vendors. And all that took about a year. Um, I think one, one thing that's important is to try not to serialize uh, dependencies. So if you can put as many elements in parallel as possible, um, that, a lot of things have a gestation period. Um, and there's really nothing you can do to accelerate. I mean, there's, it's very hard to accelerate that gesta gestation period. Um, so uh, if you can sort of have all those things gestating in parallel, uh, then, then that is one way to substantially uh, accelerate your timeline. I think people tend to serialize things too much. 